Hello and welcome to another episode of My Summer Car. Actually, this is episode 9, season 2. So what we're going to do is today we're going to get this car running properly again. I believe someone said it was a distributor, but uh, I don't think it is that because look at the way the car is shaking. If you look up, crankshaft symptoms is shaking. So I'm going to replace the crankshaft and the pistons today. And if that doesn't work it, then we'll start looking into other issues it could be. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to park her in here. Uh, let's put it in neutral. Do that. We're going to strip her of the crankshaft and the pistons. So we're probably going to want to remove the hood. There we go. Uh, we're going to need the socket set. We're going to have to lean in and grab it. Because being a dick, as always. There we go. Right. So if we get this set up here. Uh, what is it to remove the hood? It's size... Oh my god, come on. Right. Uh, size 8 in it. So, right, let's do that. Um, actually, we don't need to do that. Is it 8? No, size 6. Oh, there we go. So if we undo that one and that one hopefully we've got enough oil um, if we get this done in time then we'll um, we'll be driving to Timo's anyway to uh, get more bottles do a bit of food shopping and everything else so how far away right, we should be able to use this without causing any bloody unnecessary damage so if we get you right under there and uh, let's lower you Oh, what? Can't go. Right, let's do that then. All the way down. That's it. I think we just heard a click. It's a size 10, isn't it? There we go. Did we get the bolts? Let's have a look. Yes, we did. Excellent. Right, let's do them up. Get this. Like I said, I want to get this done as quickly as possible because we've got a lot to do today. And then a size 11. Actually. Uh, size... 14. Have we got a. Yeah, because we need to undo these bits. No, it's size 15, isn't it? No, 14. I was right. I just had the wrong one. Right. Uh, let's undo these. And then you. And then a size 9. And that should remove them completely. Well, yeah, they are perfect. And, and then we need a size 7 just to undo the uh, thingy majig. What do you call it? The old uh, exhaust from the headers, and then we should be good to go. Bloody nightmare, innit, eh? This car's what been built a week, and we're already having some serious inside issues. Right, so, yep, yeah, there we go. Take that off. And then, you. Looks like you moved over a bit. Right, let's push you. We need you to centre. I don't want no issues. Perfect. And then just a little bit on your end. Right, that do. Uh, size seven. Um, where are you? There you are. So let's quickly get. Can we reach it from here? No. What about from here? Yep. One. Two. Right now. We should be okay to lift this straight out. What is it? Size 11 for the bolts. So we want to do that one. That one. And that one. There we go. She's hanging. Let's go lift her up and out. Up you come. Come on. Alright. Let's bring her away from the car. Perfect. Right, hopefully I can strip her from here. Alright guys, so I'll do that and I'll see you in a sec. Alright, so we have completely stripped it now. Uh, so all we're left with is just a block. Hopefully, uh, we're going to quickly go and check to see if uh, 
our uncle's in because it'd be quicker if he's got his van. But if not, we well, can use a boat to get straight to Kataris. Please be in, please be in, please be in. Any van? Oh, that just fucking says it all, doesn't it? It's just whatever. Alright, uh, maybe. Yeah, I'll tell you what, we'll take the tractor instead. Hopefully there's enough fuel in it. Uh, so if we quickly grab the tractor, we drive over to Flataris. We want to get the crankshaft and all four pistons. And then we'll bring them straight back. Get the engine put back together as quickly as possible. And then uh, hopefully that gives us time to... Uh, uh, gives us time to quickly drive over to Timo's. Pick up... Um, some new bottles, do a bit of food shopping if we've got the money, we should do. And we'll stop over at the, um, uh, what do you call it, the uh, dump site. Yeah, we'll uh, stop over at the jump, uh, stop at the rubbish site to pick up the rest of the bottles. And hopefully, uh, we'll uh, be able to make a sale to Drunk Guy and make some extra money and yeah, um, what do you want to do? That. So hopefully this won't be a long drive. I suppose um, maybe next episode, we're, we're, um, in the morning, we'll do the wood job for that guy. I don't know how much money we get for it, but if we do a full trailer it should be a grand at least. And then, um, yeah, uh, we'll make some more kill you. Go deliver the leaflets for Timo, and, you know, we should have a really good money-making day then. So we should be able to get a lot done. And, yeah, because I still want to get the body fixed for the Satsuma. You know, I want to get the whole thing all fixed up and proper. And, yeah, then start hopefully getting her built up for the rally. But that all depends on what breaks next if anything does break, you know, so, oh, it's just one thing after another, but hopefully this will give us a bit of a break from engine troubles, you know, so, I will finish this drive, and uh, I will see you guys in a minute, alright, we are coming up to the tourist now, so we're going to go and get ourselves that new crankshaft and some shiny new pistons, I really hope that we've got enough oil to uh, put back in the car to get us to at least to Timo's. And so if we just stop there, we'll leave her running. Excellent. All right. Hello, how you doing? Terve, terve. Meet me, Carl. Right, what we got here? Oil Don't need that. Esta. Don't need that. Probably gonna need one of those soon. But we need to save money today. So if we just get that. One, two, three, four. Uh. Mm, we'll leave the head gasket for now so that's two grand so now we need to get this all into the tractor nice and safe hopefully it doesn't fall out anywhere that's it one two three one more to go oh that was cool Four. Excellent. Right. Uh, one, two, three, four. All in there. Lovely jubbly. Let's get in. Let's shut that door. They're all still in there. Wicked. Right, we need a drink. So let's have a beer. That should get our first out a bit. Right, let's go home. I don't know what that was. Everything's still in the tractor. Brilliant. Right. So we're going to go home, get the engine rebuilt. Uh, hopefully she starts and she stays idle now. Uh, we're probably going to have to retune it a bit. But once we've done that, we'll then take uh, take her for a drive, make sure she's running all perfect. And uh, go pick up some stuff from Timo's, go to the rubbish dump. Hopefully there's still plenty of time in the day after that to go drop off some kill you to a uh, drug guy. Uh, so we can finish the bucket. If not, uh, we can save that for next episode. And uh, yeah, hopefully we get the hopefully we get the drunk guy called today, so we can get the third one in. 
But uh, yeah, we'll see what my summer car has planned for us. You know? So, as long as we get the car up and running, that's all that matters for today's episode. And then we won't have to worry about any issues for hopefully the next couple of episodes. Alright? So, I will take this boring drive again, and I will see you guys in a minute. Alright, so we are finally home. It took a while. But we're here now, so we're going to pull up right on the drive and we're going to get this shit, sh shit show on the road and hopefully things are going to be better. Here we get up. Oh, that was a bit too close. Like that. Perfect. That'll do. Now let's close the throttle. Let it cut out. One, two, three, four, plus crankshaft. Perfect. Right. What the fuck happened here? This is not how we left you. Right, there we go. So let's quickly get everything out then and go straight in the car. It's going to be a nightmare, isn't it? So, crankshaft. Put you there. Hopefully, it all goes back together with no fucking bugs or issues. Like normally last time, I bloody had uh, the camshaft wouldn't go in. So I had to back out, come back in, you know, absolute nightmare. But hopefully they fix that now, that was last year. So, um, yeah, right, if I quickly get this car started, put uh, start putting this car back together and that, and then um, I need to have a shower and that, because that buzzing's going to do my head in. Probably like it's going to do yours too. And then when we're nearly done, I will see you then. Alright, I think we're coming up to the final bit, so I've just got to chuck this on the top here and get that bolted up and then we should be good to chuck it straight back in. Hopefully there'll be not that much tuning needed and yeah, hopefully she runs like a dream again for now, until next time anyway. So I think we've just got this bit and this bit and we've got the odd bits we've got to do back up inside the engine bay once we get her in. And then hopefully we're good to go. And we should be have no more bloody issues. Uh, so it's got to go in this way. Um, hopefully. I really am hoping that we haven't forgot anything. So. There. Perfect. Size 10. So let's get these done up. Then lift it up. <clears throat> uh, yep, there we go. Perfect. So let's lift her up. Up she goes. Uh, hopefully, I think that will do. What the fuck? Oh my god, man. What a piss take. Seriously, man. Come on. Right. If we get you in position, then. One. Two. Find a fucking engine. That's it. Get it back in position. Out there. Way better douchebag. There we go. Well done. And that one. So then we're doing it back up again. One. Two. And we'll try this again, shall we? Right. Hopefully we can get it just to the right height. Right. Will that go in? Oh, 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 easy, got to let go, right, if we start lowering, no, got to move her over a bit, that's it, lower, how are we looking, have the bolts showed up, it looks like they have, I can't really see though. Yep, yeah, right, so let's go grab the number 11. And where are you? That's it, you're in. Let's get you done up. One, and one over here. Two, then one more. Three. Perfect. Right. Now, 
If we get the number seven and see if the um, this thing needs doing up, I think it does. We did undo him. Yep, so get that undone. I mean, tighten back up. And then we've got to find the other things which should, I think fell down here. No? Okay, we can do it from here though. Can we? No? Alright, we'll have to do it from the top. No worries. Out we go. So we've got that one. So you need to go in. What the fuck are you doing? Oh my god. Uh, I'd love to know what's popping off. Did that go in? Right, so what's undoing? Oh, it might be uh, because they popped off and didn't make the noise, they might be bugging out and just doing it now. So what do we want? We want a size 14, isn't it? Yep, so we get that done up. One... Two, and then a size nine, and that should do the inside of the car. There we go. If we just uh, lean in there, where are they? What? Oh, it didn't go on, no? Oh, what the fuck is going on, man? Seriously? Where is it? Is it falling down? Did that one stay on? Right, that one stayed on. No, it... No, it didn't. No, it didn't at all. So, where is it? There's one. A half shaft. Oh, that one did stay on. Okay. So... Let's try and get that fucking back on again, shall we? Right, are you on this time? What size? So we should be able to do it up now. Yeah? No, I want that one. And then we want a size 9. Tightened, tightened, and tightened. Lovely, right. And then this side. One, two, three. Right, I think that is it. All we got to do now is just remove the hoist, which is a size 10. Grab that, crouch and lean. Hopefully everything is still wired up. We'll double check all the wires in that beforehand. Uh, you, that's it. Then just pump it up. it get you out of the way and uh, let's check the wires so we've got a wire going to the starter one two yep yeah, all good we should be all right I oh, look we didn't even put our bloody mud flaps on let's quickly check them on this side perfect one more to go and then we quickly put the fluids back in. And hopefully, that's it. No more. Um, let's do radiator first. That's it. Lovely jubbly. Wicked. Let's put you over there. You're not empty, are you? Nope, still good. Alright, so we've got to put this on. Yep. And then we take this off. And then we fill you up. Uh, I like a saw. Alright, that is all the oil we have. So we're definitely going to have to go to Timo's. I don't think we have any in the back. 
No. So let's shut this. Uh, let's quickly just check the oil level, make sure she's not leaking anywhere. Yeah, she doesn't seem to be. Alright, let's see if she starts. Why is she still not fucking doing it? What could it be now? Nah, she's uh, staying idle. So what just popped off though? Something just popped out of the car. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on with this game? Seriously man, this game's bugged to fuck. Uh... Okay, so the water pump just popped off and carried on spinning. So let's quickly get that tightened back up. Um, it looks like our drive gear has fallen off. Somewhere, there it is. Which explains why we're not bloody moving. So if we get that on. Um, get somewhere along there. Get some distance on it. There we go, and that is a size 6, so that means it's working, it just stalled, so that's good. Uh, we put in the back seat, didn't we? <clears throat> this game, man, I'll tell you what, when you try to fix your car, the amount of bugs you get after is a fucking joke. You know, we literally only wanted to replace the crankshaft and the pistons, we've done that, and now the game just isn't fucking working properly. Uh, what do we want? Size 6. Is it? Yeah. There we go. Should do that. If we lean in, should be able to get them a bit easier. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Alright. So now we should be able to fucking get a move on and go to uh, Timo's rather before he shuts so we can get on with the rest of our bloody game. Right. There we go. Uh, shut you. Do you. Start you up. Right, good. Seatbelt. Handbrake. Now we know she's going to get warm really quick because she's barely got any oil. Alright, let's go. We're going to have to take a nice easy drive. Because we don't want it to get too hot. And that's exactly what she will do. If we drive like a bloody lunatic. <coughs> but hopefully everything goes well now. If she starts getting too hot too quickly, we just turn her off and try and roll. Hopefully we're coming up to a hill or something, you know. Makes it a bit better. But we're getting tired now, so... Probably should have had some coffee beforehand, but uh, we should be fine. So oil and a new oil filter we're going to need, otherwise it contaminates the oil and it like goes really bad really quickly and we don't want that to happen. So and we do need to get it done quick, so as soon as we get there we'll do it there and then, otherwise it will um, ruin our head gasket quicker. You know, and we've not long replaced that, so... Yeah. We'll see what happens. Hopefully things go well now. Hopefully the game starts sorting itself out. Alright, so I'll take this drive. Hopefully we survive, and I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, we are coming up to Timo's now. We're coming into town. We managed to keep the engine levels, the temperatures, quite reasonable. So, yeah, we're good. Right, and lovely jubbly. And here come the gnats. 
I can't believe we can hear them while we're driving. That's annoying. So, if we just park outside the front. That's it. Let's shut her off. Uh, pop the hood. Shut her off. Like a saw. Handbrake. Check. Alright. We shouldn't need the ratchet set for anything. There we go. Look. Fully stocked. So, if we buy all of these. Pay for them quick. Just so I can get one out now and use it. That's it. And we'll put that in the car. Then we've always got one. Lovely. Right, do that. Oh, the fucking door, man. Put you in the back. Close you. Right. Uh, so, we want one, two, three, four, five, six. We want loads of sausages. And we want the milk. And I think that is it. Oh, wait, we need some of this. Um, we'll take all of that, and then we shouldn't have to buy any more for a while. How much is that? 321. We're going to need a pack of cigarettes now. Uh, yeah, let's get a couple of pizzas. And that... Oh, wait. Oil filter. And oil. Did we get oil? No? There we did. Right. 414. Lovely jubbly. We'll put you there. Let's grab this quick. Uh, put you there. We need to open this. Let's empty... Oh, please be the last one that was in there. Yes, look at that. What a touch. Uh, right, we want you. Because we need to empty that old oil out quick. So if we do that, grab you. Number two. So that's 13. Let's lean in there. Change it. There we go. Let's let that drain out. While that's draining out, we can remove the oil filter. That's it, can we grab it? Perfect, so we put that in the um, the boot. So we can put that in the uh, burn pile. Where's the new one? There it is. If we get some distance on it. You go somewhere around there. No, I'm not guessing. We've wasted enough time today as it is. So you go on. Uh, it's just being a right cock, isn't it? Oh, fuck off, flies. There we go. Right, that's that. Right, let's go and do this up. And let's put the new oil in. And then we should be good to go. If we then we uh, we'll drive over to the rubbish site quick. Uh, pick up the old bottles. Drive back home. And then uh, fill them up with some kill you. Would depend on the time. Maybe we'll sell them to him on Friday. And we'll just leave that all for our money making day. And then yeah. We'll just wait around for drunk guy's phone call. And hopefully we get it. And yeah. Hopefully it all goes well man. We just got to wait and see. But at least for now. The car is up and running. Properly. For how long? I couldn't tell you. But yeah. Hopefully for a while. Uh, let's chuck you in the back, put you in the back. Let's do you up. That's it, quickly check the dipstick. Look at that, nice. Alright, let's pick you up. We'll put you in the boot. And let's get the fuck out of here. That's it, shut you up. Do that. Right, so next stop, the dump site. Stay idle, bitch. Lovely. Right, let's go. Hopefully the temperatures stay normal now. We just turn around here. Oh, a little bit of a wheel spin there. Oh yeah, she's running proper now. Oh, we should have got fuel. Uh, don't matter, we should be alright. We'll see how much we got when we get um, get um, If we need to top it up to pick drunk guy up, we will. Um, clear. 
Yeah, I think we're good. Let's go. Excellent. Right, we're going to need them headlights on now. Right, look at them temperatures, man. That's, they seem to be quite stable. So, next stop, rubbish site. Let's do it. Let's go and pick up them bottles, and then we've got all of them. Then there'll be uh, 12 bottles of Kill You we should be able to sell tomorrow, depending on how much is in the um, bucket. But we've got the uh, we've got more ingredients now, so we can um, make some more as soon as it's empty. So there's no uh, there's no setbacks there. But how exciting is this? There's only three days left until Cyberpunk, and there's no signs of it being pushed back any further. You know they've, they're advertising it on TV now, so it looks like this could be legit. So if it is. We're probably going to be live streaming it on Thursday as soon as it's installed on the computer. He was going well fast, that red car. Yeah, so as soon as it's installed, we'll be going live, hopefully for about four hours. And, uh, yeah, so, and then obviously after that, we'll, um, we'll do a couple of episodes. Um,. Throughout the week, and then we'll probably have another live stream at some point because it's a big game, so I want to get it. Lovely, right? Yeah, look, the sun's it's getting quite dark now, so we're gonna have to get home soon. It definitely won't be any kill you selling today, but if we can get drunk, I picked up, then that'd be great. Is it up there? Slow it down a bit. Straight around. Lovely. This is going to be a nightmare when it's 20 bottles, isn't it? Eh? We just park it there. We'll leave her running. What is that? There's a bloody lottery ticket that we lost. How weird. We need to check that. So if we do you, two. Three. Right, it's taking ages. Throw you. Okay. That's it. So this will be four, five, and six, and then we can get straight on. Get a shit shower to shave. Hopefully, we get a phone drunk of the the drunk guy phone call, and then we can get uh, get that one step closer. Uh, Seatbelt, and let's go home. Nice and easy. Hopefully we didn't do too much damage driving with literally no oil. She seems to be fine, so we'll just have to wait and see. But um, I'm going to take this drive home, and I'll see you at the driveway. Alright, we are home, finally. And it looks like there's a storm brewing. So, yeah, we're going to get straight inside. We can shut up the garage door now. Well, that was a bit of an overturn, wasn't it? There we go. If we turn the lights off so they don't blow. Turn them off. There we go. We'll leave everything in the car for now. Depends on the time. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's 9 o'clock. So I need to quickly get shit shower shaved. So let's quickly do that. Uh, we don't need to pee. Uh, we do need a drink. Let's quickly do that and then pee. We should be alright for time. Lovely. Let's turn that off. Quickly have something to eat. Last pack of sausages. We go taller. There we go. Right, let's quickly get in here. What's going on here? There we go. Right. Uh, yeah, let's quickly have a shower, get rid of the flies, and then we can go straight to bed. There we go. Lovely and clean. Shut that door. Do that. Spray ourselves. 
Hopefully the phone's working. Actually, do you know what? Let's really go and check the phone bill. Right, phone bill's good. Let's go to sleep. Alright, let's shut this door here. Lovely. Let's go to sleep. And hopefully we get the phone call. What's the time? Ah, uh, no phone call. No worries. Alright, so I guess we'll call it an episode there. It'll probably be Friday. Yeah, it'll probably be next this Friday night. So next uh, next episode we should get a phone call. Alright, so if you're enjoying season two and you're new to the channel, maybe consider subscribing and uh, hitting that like button. Yeah, you know, so uh, and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're always notified when there's a new upload, which is mostly Mondays for my summer car. Sometimes it could be a Tuesday, depending on what's going on. Uh, but yeah, and as always, thank you for watching. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one.